concerns over radium-tainted water, water wells and traffic dog a building proposal. Newcastle, critics of a plan to expand the Sunshine Children's Home are already gearing up for a lawsuit ahead of a planned vote on Wednesday. For years, locals have been fighting the expansion over traffic, environmental and safety concerns, but they're not expecting the town's zoning board of appeals to side with them, we don't have any doubt that they're going to approve it and that we'll have to go to the court for resolution. Adam Stolaro, an attorney for Cynthia Manicharian, told the Journal News, Lohud. Sunshine, key approval granted by town weather, did tornadoes hit northern Westchester? Attorney General, Yorktown State Senator named to vetting, committee opponents have already filed two Article 78 legal proceedings contesting town land use approvals for the planned expansion, but a judge has yet to issue a decision. On Wednesday, the board will vote on an amended site plan during a special meeting. Stolaro said although the board is the lead agency under the required environmental review process, its members have continually said during the latest round of approvals that the concerns raised about the project don't fall within the scope of the site plan review. Minimum, he said, the board should require the plan to accurately reflect all the work that is being done on site. Opponents say the plan show the work being done near one of the on-site water wells or reflect the total trees it will have to remove. The facility on Spring Valley Road provides housing and services for children with debilitating medical issues. Its owners are looking to expand the facility from 54 to 118 beds, but its opponents have taken issue with the plan from the get-go. They say Sunshine has done construction work without permits and hasn't been made to conduct a full review of environmental impacts on the area. Access to the site by emergency workers and traffic impact estimates have also been questioned. The facility is on a well water system and one of its three wells tested for high levels of radium. The well was shut down, but put back in service while a separate well was being deepened. Critics even question whether the water supply will be enough to meet the demand for a facility of its size. Some residents say the potential impacts on adjacent water systems hasn't been properly studied. For Cynthia Manicharian, even calling a special meeting was evidence that the board was committed to moving the process through with the idea Sunshine had waited long enough, in the public's mind, the review hasn't been a deep enough dive and they haven't been waiting long enough, she said. Certainly, when there are questions about the quality of water, the amount of water, all sorts of questions that are unresolved, what's the rush, the project, on the west end of town near its border with Ossining, Croton on Hudson, Portland and Yorktown, has been picked apart by residents in the area over several years. It even led to the formation of an opposition group. The Article 78 challenge last year looked to void a special permit and two variances for the expansion, and also questioned the board's determination that the project wouldn't have any adverse environmental impacts. At the time of the court filing, a spokeswoman for Sunshine said in a statement it was heart-wrenching for us to hear that some people are spending time and money to prevent critically ill children from having the peace and comfort of a home at Sunshine. The chairman of the zoning board didn't return an email seeking comment. A spokesperson for Sunshine didn't immediately reply to an email. Representatives of the board have previously said they believe the record shows they have taken a hard look at the proposal. Follow Mark Lungarello on Facebook, at Lungarello, Twitter, at Mark Lungarello. Read or share the story, https colon slash slash www.lohud.com slash story slash news slash local slash Westchester slash new dash castle slash 2018 slash 05 slash 16 slash sunshine dash children's dash home slash 61316800 slash